Danny D and I have a special edition of Danny's Dish right now. I have Indy's own Pike High School student Madison Holter here with me, also her boyfriend Trey. How you guys doing today? I'm good. Uh, girl, you are famous, right? Twitter? I guess. Uh huh. No, you are. So you went to prom on April 29th. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh, and I saw the pics of you. You looked absolutely gorgeous Thank in your you. pink dress with the sequins. <laughs> Trey, you looked fly. Your pictures <laughs> were fly. But that all came to an end, that good part of it all, when you saw a specific tweet when you got home from Twitter. I mean, from Twitter. <laughs> when you got home from prom, right? Right. Okay, so what was that tweet that you saw? Okay, so when I turned on my phone after prom, I saw a tweet and it said, Wow, he loves you even though you're fat. Must be nice. And I was just like, so I took a screenshot, I didn't say anything back, and I was just like, I can't see how people can be so rude to people they don't know. Just a general statement because I feel like cyberbullying is a real thing that not a lot of people realize can affect people so much. And your words online can hurt more than you think they can. So. Definitely. So how did it make you feel? It just brought back a bunch of things from my past. Like, I struggled with my weight all my life and but at the same time through the help of Trey I've like learned to love myself and learn to be confident in myself so I was just like it doesn't hurt as much as it used to but it's still kind of that sensitive side that you hold on to of course and you should feel good about yourself because you're absolutely beautiful you <laughs> fly you. I saw <laughs> the pictures beautiful. myself um and that tweet that you sent out actually went viral Mm -hmm. And you had people complimenting you so much to the point where, did the girl get rid of her Twitter? Yeah, she either uh, got it deactivated because people were reporting it, or she just changed her handle. She still has a Twitter, and she's still been tweeting stuff, but... Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, no. She should have been scared because people were going in on her <laughs> and complimenting you. You see, you took the high road, so I commend you for that. Thank you took you. the high road. Everybody else took care of that dirty laundry, and you still living your life with your wonderful boyfriend, <laughs> Trey, here. You even tweeted something, right? Yeah. Taking up for your girl. What was that tweet? Um, I said, uh, you're not fat. Like, God made you just for me. Like, you're perfect. And, um... A lot of people think like it was like for clout or like seeking attention, but I've been we've been together for like a whole year, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And nothing we ever posted ever went viral. I was just saying that because I want that confidence to still stay there. And like I was thinking, either I can like bash this female for what she just said, or I can make the person who's actually being affected by this feel good. So I mean, God led me in the right direction, of course. And I didn't even expect it to go viral, but since it did, you know maybe it can like help other people that's like struggling with the same thing. So. You definitely will. I definitely commend you both on that. Um, one last thing, what do you have to say to body shamers or people who just make people feel bad, period? It's just the fact that everyone is different and unique. I don't believe that there's anything called normal. And God really made us all who we are for a reason. I look the way I do for a reason. He does too. And maybe my reason for being the way I am is to make an impact on others. And so I, I don't want any negativity to go towards anybody that says negative stuff about us because that's what this is all about to us, just making everyone feel good about themselves and know that if you know who you are and you love who you are, it doesn't matter what people think of you. Awesome, and y'all look good, so keep shining, baby. You about to graduate. Trey told me 14 days. Right. He got the countdown in his head. Really? So Indy's own, Pike High School's own, I thank you so much for being here with me and being so positive as young people. So thank you so much. Thank you.